Good evening, family. This video today is going to be about eggshells or how I save my eggshells for fertilization of my plants. I was sitting here today as I was potting up my seedlings, getting my seedlings ready for my summer and fall garden. And I kept getting, um, or I always get this same question um, all the time over on my um, Facebook group. Um, which, by the way, if you have not joined my Facebook group, um, please do so. Um, it's Garden Time with Sunshine um, on Facebook. And there is like a yellow picture of a daffodil, I think it is, or a yellow li lily um, as the cover page. Um, but yeah, please go on over there and join that Facebook group as well. And um, post some questions and comments and socialize and get some questions answered and all that good stuff. Same stuff we do on YouTube. But anyway, um, the question that I always, I'm always asked is, do I save my coffee grinds or my eggshells? And the answer to that is yes, all the time. Um, and I'm gonna show you how I do that today. Um, real simple, usually I just buy the um, aluminum containers or I keep my aluminum containers um, left over from like barbecues or something like that. And when I cook eggs, I just simply save them in the container, crack the eggshells, um, and let them dry out. I save my coffee grinds the same way. I just throw them in this container, the coffee filter and all, and then I just rub all the coffee off of it and throw the filter into the compost bin because um, it is biodegradable. It's usually made out of recycled paper and um, it, will biodegrade, it will degrade. Um, but yeah, I usually um, save them both in the containers and I will either crush them in the container and put them into a bigger container, like such, with the lid. This is a mixture of um, eggshells and coffee grinds. And sometimes I put cinnamon in here as well, just to keep like the gnats and stuff away. Uh, when I go to sprinkle my um, eggshells on top of the plants, you know, sometimes the little gnats um, will get on your seedlings and try to eat your seedlings. Um, and the cinnamon will help deter them. So I mix it together. Um, and sometimes I just have a container of just eggshells. But this is how I do it. I take my eggshells and I take a gallon size Ziploc bag. I just drop the eggshells down in the bag. A few at a time. And then I just crush them. Crush them, crush them, crush them. And then I put them in the container. Some people like to bake their eggshells. Um, they seem to think that if they um, bake the eggshells that it speeds up the process of pulling out the um, calcium or nitrogen, whatever that it provides for the plant. Um, some people beg to differ and say that you get the same um, qualities if you don't. And I don't bake mine. I just keep them um, just like this and let them dry out. And um, put them on my plants after they after they dry out and the coffee grinds when you mix them together that helps the process I think um, and it works for me so um, just find a method that works for you I try to use anything that's natural you know for fertilization and um, those two things work for me I also um, save orange peelings in a container with just water in my in the orange peelings and that works as well and then everybody knows that banana water, just drop your um, banana peels down in some water and that works as well. My banana water has worked wonders for me. I've had some droopy plants or plants that I thought were completely dead and I put my banana water on them and they come right back. They just thrive, come right back. So give it a try. And that's gonna be it. I just wanted to do a quick video just to answer some of those questions um, that I have been that I have been getting on my Facebook page. Um, thought that maybe someone else out there could um, use the answer or need that same question answered. So um, there it is. Save your eggshells, save your coffee grinds, and use them as natural um, fertilizers. Um, that's gonna be it. I'll wrap up this video. And if you have not liked and subscribed, um, please do so. Um, I also want to say congratulations to Ms. Renee for making 1,000 subscribers today. Yay! That was awesome. I love watching your channel. 
Um, but that's it. Quick video. Save your eggshells. Save your coffee grinds and let them go to work for you. Y'all have a good evening. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.